Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, in front of you is my new project that is a mobile phone. I am using a LPC2148 ARM7 core to power this project and uh, I have used other modules uh, connected with the LPC2148 uh, to work as the whole uh, mobile phone. I am powering this board right now with my laptop and uh, 5 volt uh, that is running the main processor and the uh, GLCD and other peripherals. Whereas uh, my main uh, that is uh, SIM 900 that is the GSM module is powered using a 12 volt adapter that is connected on the wall AC supply right now. So if you look closely we are having the SIM 900 module that is connected with the uh, LPC2148 uh, using the UART communication serial communication. We are having the GLCD that is Nokia uh, 5110 uh, uh, GLCD that is using connected using SPI. Uh, we are having the microphone here that is used for uh, that is uh, used for the voice transmission if i turn this board back you can see i am having a 3.3 volt rtc battery that is powering the rtc i am having the main lpc 2148 board and the lpc is connected in the rear side of the board in the between so i have made this in a small package that's why the whole LPC is not visible right now it's in between this the speaker is in between the board this uh, GPB and the uh, LCD it's a sorry GLCD module so you can see the speaker is right here so if I keep it in my ear so I can use it like a normal mobile so this is about the hardware that I am using now in this video I'll be showing you uh, the about the programming part about the how this calling and uh, all these things are done so now uh, I have connect, disconnected this module right now from my 5 volt supply. Now I will connect it back into my laptop USB port that will supply a 5 volt for the LPC214 it. That is further con uh, converted into 3.3 volts. Now this is booting up and we can see some logos and uh, this kind of smiley. So we are having the RTC in the right corner of the GLCD. In the left corner we are having the menu. So uh, let's see the how the menus work. So uh, like this is the main menu that is uh, opened up. So this is the for the calling feature. These two buttons are for the up and down. If I press this I will um, can traverse through the menu. Like this is for uh, sending a SMS. This is for receive, uh, seeing the received SMS. This is for uh, setting the time and seeing the time. Like if I click OK. So you can kindly see today's date and current time. I can further set it. Uh, but I don't want to set it right now so I will go back and I have again come to the main menu I, I will press it again so if I traverse again so these are the settings that can uh, change settings of the LPC 2148 uh, this one is clock I have showed you uh, this one is for receiving text message this is for transmitting the text message and this is for calling I will explain all this feature so guys uh, now in front of us is our mobile phone project we will now test the calling feature of our project so i will enter the call button so now i am in the uh, number entering mode and i will enter the number please tell the number 97 9 it is the final number yeah. then I will press the call button and now call is going and we'll, we are expecting a call in this mobile so we are getting a call now what I will do I will try to disconnect the call from here I will press the end button so I have pressed the end button and uh, that call has disconnected and uh, I am seeing a missed call here that's all for the calling feature in this video we will be sending a text message to this uh, mobile from our project mobile so in this uh, i have to go to the uh, menu of the sending message so this is the call menu this is the message sending menu i will press ok and first i have to enter the number tell me the number 97 97 80 80 860 860 940 94 Zero. So this is the number. Now I will press the message button, and we, now we have to type the message. 
just we are randomly typing a message like one two three then uh, let's type some characters if we uh, double double type then i will get a then if i have triple type then b like this this is alphanumeric keyword so we can type abcd also now after this let's send this message so i will press the send button and uh, it's sending and we'll be expecting a message in this mobile after some time okay so we have received a message i will open it and uh, we can see that we have received that exactly the same message that we have sent from our module thank you for saying bye